on TikTok, Instagram, X, and Facebook. Ladies, here are seven qualities you need to look for in a man. Mm -hmm. Ladies, here are ten red flags you need to look for in a man. And these ninjas not married. They running games on women. Or if they are married, they're disrespectful, not honoring their covenant. But everybody is marketing towards black women. You have these women doing wife schools. You have these non-black women doing wife boot camps targeting black women. Because everybody sees us as desperate and lonely and anxious to have a man. And they feel like they can make money off of our backs. And like we can't get married and, and be our, happy. And here go our beautiful sister Toya just got married. Right. And I just mm -hmm. feel like Sonya is one of those type of black women that those people on social media market to. Mm -hmm. That's why she's always parroting what she hears on Andrew Tate and other places about women and relationships. That's why you always hear her say how she doesn't believe in nagging a man. She doesn't believe in going through a man's phone. She believes in trusting a man which is all fine and dandy i get that but i think i think she's saying it not from a place of maturity but from a place of i'm not like them other women yeah i'm better yeah and i just when she was talking and saying those things to her so it just made me think of that like dang everybody see us as black women as being desperate and just thirsty for love and acceptance and everybody want to try to you know target us and and use us to make money off of here's let me teach you how to get a man subscribe to this get in my boot camp join my patreon join this join that and i'll teach you buy my book do this do that and it's like damn like mm -hmm. <clears throat> and and why why is it that that it, it's geared to black women you don't never see anybody getting on the social media talking about let's help a white woman get a husband white women the percentage of white women getting married is this and, and and white women can't find a man and 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 white women are single why why we don't hear that because they single too and they complain about dating in relationships Becky single? yes Becky single yes and they complain about the dating pool too but the thing i think the difference is with white women it's more like classier and sexier when they when because they write books to teach them how to get a man they have dating coaches too like but it's, sex in the city it's more yeah it's more positive y'all see how they made them girls look like it was okay to be single sex in the city and hoes and hoes the white girlfriends the white girlfriends but on girlfriends we was always crying and whining but on, Come sex on in the city, Samantha. they gave them more dignity when they whined they they weren't as down as out as we were. They gave yes. them more dignity. That's the difference. That's they the give difference. them more dignity. It's not that we're different. Like they don't go through the same issue that they we go through because we all know men are men are men no are matter men. what no color. matter race color creed or ethnicity. But the thing is, they give them more dignity and more grace. Mm -hmm. That's what it is. They get dignity and they get more grace. With us, we get shame.